everyone, welcome back to another episode of Mumbles. Today I have a special guest with me. This is my dog, Ruby. And Ruby wanted me to send a special message out for this 4th of July because there are some real dangers for animals on the 4th of July. So she wanted me to make sure that I paid special attention and put out a video to try to help some of these other animals. Now, as, I don't know if some of you know or not, but here, lay down, Ruby. Now, I don't know if some of you know or not, but Fourth of July can be a very stressful time for animals. Pets, domestic, non-domestic, all kinds of animals get very scared and upset during Fourth of July. So there are a couple tips I wanted to bring to you guys so that hopefully your pet can have a, a safe and stress-free Fourth of July. Now, as we all know, Fireworks are very, very pretty, but they make a loud boom, and they scare, they scare especially animals. So please, this 4th of July, make sure to uh, protect your animal, watch your animal. If you're going to go out to a fireworks show or anything like that, make sure that if you can't take your animal with you, make sure that you put your animal in a, in a place that's not too hot, not too cold, but someplace where they can't get out, because if you leave them outside, and they get scared, they may try to, you know, jump the fence or uh, try to get away from it because they're scared. And we all know how we act when we're scared. We try to get away from that harm. So that's, that's my first thing. Make sure that you put them someplace, uh, you know, safe so that they can't get out. Because every 4th of July, hundreds and thousands of animals do go missing because they're scared. And nope, I, I don't want to see any of you guys lose a pet because of this. Now the second thing that you can do is if you have a dog or cat or any kind of animal that gets very scared, you can take them to your local vet and they may give you, now I know Ruby because she gets very scared. She's scared of thunder. She's scared of that kind of stuff. Um, so they give, we asked, we started this last year. Uh, we asked for tranquilizers. Basically they help, you know, they, they calm the dog or the animal down. And hopefully, she's probably just going to take a, you know, a nice little nap during that time. Now, obviously, all these, these things are safe. You want to make sure that you get good stuff and, and stuff like that. So, I would, I would definitely recommend for you to go to a vet because, you know, some of this stuff over the counter or, you know, a, a person's prescription is not good for a dog. So, you definitely want to make sure you get the right thing. So, your vet can definitely help you in making the 4th of July a enjoyable time for your pet. The final thing that I want to uh, caution you guys about is just, just be smart. Um, now, this goes for both you and your animals. Make sure that you're, you, know, you, know, you do things safely. If you're going to light fireworks this year, please make sure that you use your mind and you're, you're cautious. These are dangerous explosives, and no, we don't want to see anybody lose any fingers. We don't want to see any dogs hurt. We don't want to see anything catch on fire. So please make sure that you use your brains when you're dealing with these fireworks. Even if you're just going to a show, uh, you know, make sure that you follow the rules that they give you. Ruby and I definitely do not want to see any of you on Twitter or on Facebook or anywhere where you've lost a dog or you've lost, you know, something's happened to you because of this. So just be smart, be safe, and try to follow these, these uh, few tips that I've given you. Uh, and, and as always, you know, just do the best you can. Have fun. I'm not saying don't have fun. Just do it safely. Make sure your pet's protected. Make sure you're protected. All right, everyone, this is going to be another episode of Mumbles, and we're going to be signing off. So I want to thank you all so much for watching. Ruby wants to thank you for watching. And, yeah, this is going to be Mumbles signing off. You can follow me on Twitter at the underscore Mumbles underscore. Please subscribe if you like the video, share it with your friends, make sure that everyone knows to be safe this 4th of July, and I want to thank you again all for watching. This is going to be Mumbles and Ruby signing off. Thank you everyone for watching. Bye-bye.